Hey yo, what's good, man? We here NOC TV DVD, man. We here with crazy artists out of Jersey, man. State your name. My name is Stevie Franks, man. I'm coming from out of Longside, New Jersey, man. One thing I just want to say, I appreciate NOC for allowing me to be on this DVD. I appreciate NOC allowing me to come through. You already know, love, man. You know what I'm saying? And, and appreciate because I'm really, I'm just, I'm just breaking the grounds right now. You know what I'm saying? And um, I appreciate them very highly. You know what I'm saying? Um, I just came out with a mixtape uh, slash album called Self Porch, but you can go and look me up on steviefranks.bandcamp.com slash album slash self portrait. You know what I'm saying? If you want to go take a peek, you know what I mean? I ain't asking too much for it, only it's only $5, you know what I'm saying? So, <coughs> I'm saying support your boy or whatever. Support, you know what man. I'm That's all it's I'm, about, it's support, man. Yeah, you already boy. know, man. So, uh, so, how long you been involved with hip hop? Um, I've been involved with hip hop since I was about like, I say about like, 14, but um, I started writing raps when I was like 12, you know what I'm saying? And um, I could already tell I was on to something because my first rap that I wrote was called Lonely Road, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And it's like real deep, you know what I'm saying? And um, I had, uh, we started with, it was me, it was me about my neighbor and my brother, and um, we had a little group or whatever, you know what I'm saying? We would basically take characters that we've seen off the television screen, act them out in freestyle, and go around a cipher in a circle. Um, then as I got older, probably like around like 17, I was in a group called uh, CSOM, it was about like five of us. And we, that was when we actually started taking it seriously. I mean, it was real vinyl, like real gritty. We was in a, we was in a, a garage, like no heat, no nothing. We all we had was a tape deck, an old mic, you know what I'm saying? And um, we got it rocking like that. But some people had stuck with it, some people didn't. And um, you know, that's how I got started off. That's and, what it is, man. So uh so how'd the name Stevie Franks come about? <laughs> that's crazy. I get this question all the time. Um, Stevie Franks actually came about it was actually real rap. I'm gonna be honest, you started out as a joke. Like uh my man, you know what I'm saying, he down or whatever right now, but um while he was home he used to call me. Um, and, and just just call him with crazy nicknames. His first nickname was like Domestics because I had this girl I was always arguing with. <laughs> um, then the next one was like uh, something, something to deal with money. And then one day he popped up and said Stevie Frank. So I started laughing. I said, where the hell did you get that name from? And he's like, I, I, like, I don't know, man. It was just a joke. But my, my rap name originally was Theory. You know what I'm saying? And um, I, was taught, I was in the uh, studio with my engineer one day or whatever. And he was like, yo, what's your name again? I said, theory. He was like, okay. And then later on that day, he called me. He was like, what your man call you again? I said, uh, Stevie Franks. He said, yeah, theory sounds cool, but Stevie Franks just got like a whole lot more character to it. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? A whole lot more feel. Like you can play with it a little bit more. You know what I'm saying? And I think that reflects upon your character as well. No you know doubt. I mean? No doubt, man. That's the truth, so, man. So uh, Stevie Franks, man, where you see yourself in the next five years, man? With everything going on with the music, the hip hop, life in general, man, where you see yourself in the next five years? The next five years, I, I can't, I can, I can call it, but I can't. You know what I'm saying? I, I, only, only God knows. I'm just gonna keep on grinding, and uh, hopefully something will break for me. I'm not really looking for too much of a deal, but mainly just in a big enough fan base and, you know, uh, following enough the situation enough to help help me help other artists that I'm dealing with you know what I'm saying uh, help feed me and my fam you know what I mean no doubt man so who and what is your motivation to do what you do my motivation my motivation probably my life in general you know what I mean I, I my life story is like is, is, is up and down you know what I mean and it's just like I feel as though like a lot of times people should hear it you know what I mean? And, and like that's I, I feel as though like people rap, but I, I'm like a poet. You know what I'm saying? I take one thing and then turn it into something else, but in a poetic manner. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Good money, and man. And I try to uh, paint a picture more so, but it's mainly of my my life experiences. And what motivates me, I guess, is just the fact of I need this because it's like my therapy. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? I feel like if I don't write a rap, some days I go crazy. You know what I'm saying? It's like a, a million one words are floating around in my head, and I just gotta get them out on. Gotta paper. get them out, man. You know yeah, what I'm that's that's, so that's good money. That's great motivation, man. So, uh, man. so uh, how you feel about this battle rap shit going on around the way, man? I feel I, honestly, I think it's good. I think it's great because South Jersey needs needs a uh, needs something. You know what I'm saying? We need a movement. We need people to actually want to support us. 
Um, we need to support one another. Um, we need to come together more often, not just for battles, but more so artists that want to try to do some, make events, you know. We need to come together as a unit and move because we're so small. And since we're so small and there's so many of us that's doing it, we should already have like a league and a movement supporting each other. You know what I'm saying? Speaking so, of the devil, man, so how you feel about the NOC then? If you if you if you're talking like that, I mean, you know, NOC's from originated in South Jersey. How you feel I, about the NOC and where it's going, that's my boy? What I mean, that's that that's, that's in a sense, that's what I was speaking on. Mm -hmm. I was really speaking on towards NOC. Like I said, I told like I said in the beginning of the interview, I love what they're doing and, and it's just great for them. Because it's it's they basically it's, it's 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 slowly, slowly, but going to be something really, really big, and they're making artists that, um, that were nothing into something, and that's great. You know what I mean? Anything that comes from just coming from the bottom, and and coming up and, and making people like Dre Dennis, like I like it's crazy because I Dre, Dre Dennis, he from around my way. He a little dude. You know what I'm saying? Like he little, he not little no more. You know what I'm saying? He tall and big, but he grown. <laughs> but I know him for being little, little. You know what I'm saying? Little. What, you know what I'm saying? Little, little dude. You know what I mean? I don't know. I didn't know him for rapping. And this created an opportunity for him to actually spread his wings and bring about a certain level of popularity within himself. Not for his ego, but mainly for um, future endeavors that he might be able to get into and create a situation. No doubt, man. So you already know, man. Much love, much appreciation to Stevie Franks. We in the building, man. NOC TV DVD, man. You got any shout outs? Um, yeah, shout out to my engineer, uh, Raheem Samad, for uh, helping me sharpen my skills and help get me um, where I'm at. Um, shout out to everybody who's contributed, everybody to who supported my, uh, my mixtape drop and my and my album drop, you know what I'm saying? Um, shout out to my man, uh, Stan the General. Shout out to Prov. Shout out to Cove. Um, shout out to Screw Tape. Um, shout out to the whole Corfu movement, you know what I'm saying? Um, shout out to any uh, South Jersey rapper, anybody, shout out to Prophet, shout out to anybody who I feel as though is, uh, is, is trying to do something with themselves from South Jersey and just keeping the hip hop movement alive in general. You, you know already know, man. Stevie Franks, NOC TV, DVD, man, we out. Yeah, yeah.